Netflix's new three-part documentary series American Murder, Lacey Peterson, released on August 14, shares more details about Scott Peterson's lover Amber Frey. The convicted murderer started seeing her amid his marriage to Lacey Peterson, who was found dead months after she went missing on Christmas Eve in 2002. At the end of the first part of the true crime show, the Modesto Police Department revealed they received over 11,000 tips from people across the country amid the investigation two decades ago. Senior clerk Beverly Valdivia received one call from a woman who identified herself as Scott's lover. Woman states Scott Peterson is her boyfriend. Has been dating for a number of months. Speak on phone daily, the screen in the documentary showed. The caller told Modesto Police Department Detective Al Brocchini her name was Amber. Amber revealed she was a single mom to her daughter, Ayanna Frey, when she met Scott. Meanwhile, he insisted he wasn't in a relationship with anyone then. Where did Scott Peterson and Amber Frey meet? In the documentary, Amber revealed she met Scott while living in Madera, Rolling Hills. They started talking on the phone afterward and developed a special bond. I asked if he had ever been married. He said no. I asked if he had children. He said no, never wanted to, Amber recalled. I believe he said Ayanna would be enough for him. However, a guy who worked for Scott ran into one of Amber's best friends and told her the truth about his marital status. On December 9, 2002, Scott visited Amber and confessed to lying. At this point, he's crying and having a hard time talking and said he had lost his wife and it'd be first holidays without her, said Amber. I remember just comforting him, understanding this must be very hard. I didn't know. Maybe she died in a car accident. There were all these thoughts. Amber denied being Scott's mistress during a press conference in January 2003 amid the search for Lacey. I am very sorry for Lacey's family, she said in the footage. And the pain this has caused them and I pray for her safe return as well. In 2004, Scott underwent a murder trial where Amber became a star witness. He was found guilty of the first-degree murder of Lacey and the second-degree murder of their infant son in November of the same year. Amber came across as one of the most credible people you could ever hear testify, said Amber's then attorney, Gloria Allred. And Scott Peterson on those recordings came across as one of the biggest liars one could ever hear. What happened to Amber Frey after the trial? A year after Scott received the verdict, Amber released her 2005 book Witness, which detailed her experience during the trial. She also continued her job as a massage therapist after the shocking phase in her life. Where is Amber Frey now? Following the case, Amber has continued living in Fresno, California with her daughter. She currently serves as an ambassador for the pre-workout drink fucked up.